Hello YouTube fam, welcome to Tekken Armory. I am Millie, and today we are going to show you that some of Lydia's stance shift attacks is punishable. You need to know how to punish those properly, as the frame data in the lab will not show you how punishable they can be. Without further ado, let's begin. This is her 1-2-2. It shifts to cat stance on block or hit. At the lab, it shows it is safe at minus eight. However, since it shift to a new stance, it is quite punishable. You can use a punisher up to 16 frames to punish this. This is her up forward four. This one shows as minus five or minus 20 at the lab. But if Lydia is holding back after, it should be minus 13. This next one is her quarter circle forward one plus two, two. It shifts to wolf stance after hit or block. This one can be punishable up to 14 frames. This one is her cat stance four. It shifts to wolf stance on hit or block and it is a low. It can be punished by using a wild standing punisher up to 14 frames. This one is her cat stance one plus two. This also shifts into wolf stance after hit or block. It can be punished up to 11 frames. This one is her down back three. This low sweep shifts into horse stance on hit or block. This is punishable up to 19 frames while standing. If you want to know more on how to punish Lydia, check out this video here. Guys, thank you so much for watching my video. Feel free to comment your feedbacks and suggestions. Also, please leave a like and subscribe if you want to watch more content like this.